chicken soup for boys? I was wondering if there were any chicken soup books aimed at boys for teens. Oh, I thought you meant like literal specials. Soup. Yeah, mama's, mama's, I had a like whole a mama's, chicken, mama's exquisite soup recipe. Chicken soup just filled with like Hot Wheel cars. <laughs> I had a whole joke that instead of chicken and noodles, it was chicken and doodles. All right, but all like, right. Yeah, I'm going to take that to Shark Tank and see if Sirs, I can get some, any investors. Sirs. I don't know if those books have authors or if they just like take a bunch of shit out of Reader's Digest and then they get somebody to chop and screw it. I always I, assumed I, they were the first tentative experiments of a rogue AI. Okay, yeah. Because right. you would think my chicken soup for boys would be like, don't put your fucking finger up there like don't snip don't scratch and don't tug on that don't fucking just fucking stop you know the chicken soup for the boy teen soul could just be one page with one sentence and it just says put it away just don't Do anymore you guys want to know a quick very true thing it's about the chicken soup for the soul brand large breed adult dog food <laughs> what <laughs> what because food is more than just nutrition. It's also about comfort, love, and appreciation. Here's a fucking dog food with the Chicken Soup for the Soul brand on it. Chicken Soup for the Soul brand dog food. You can't do that. You can't have two different foodstuffs <laughs> no. in the name of a product. It can't be like, what's up? This is Hamburger Helper's Kid Wine. What? <laughs> yeah, it's wine for kids, but it's made by Hamburger Helper. Because I like, I'm like... Digging deep in Amazon, and there's some like really, really good chicken soup for the soul books yeah. that are like very, very much into. As near as I can figure, they like made every book and they had a meeting. They're like, anybody come up with any other books? Uh, what about chicken soup for the prisoner soul? Nope, we did that one already. What about um, chicken soup for the soul, a book of miracles? Uh, nope, it exists. Maybe, uh, what if we did dog food? Okay, <laughs> right? sure. There is a there is a game. There's a chicken soup for the game, and I bet it's it, fucking no, 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 fun no. and shit. No, 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 no. It's not called chicken soup for the game, is it? <laughs> no, it's called chicken soup for the soul. Count your blessings. The game, okay, with an attitude of gratitude. If it was from the number one best selling uh, series, as if there was any fucking doubt. I'm disappointed to learn uh, that it's not called chicken soup for the game because if they started to follow that naming convention, they could literally sell anything. Like chip and chicken soup for the bowling ball. It's a line of high quality bowling balls. What's it have to do with chicken soup? Fuck you. Hey guys. Yeah, dude. Can I just shoot a quick review? Yeah, yeah. Hit me. Chicken soup for the soul board game. Yeah, I would love this to. This one comes to us from Seattle Mist. We thought this game sounded like good, wholesome fun, uh -oh. but it constantly references pop culture, uh -oh. which is annoying. There are lots of people who pay little or no attention to that kind of thing. So unless you're really hip, in quotes, on all the current fads, celebrities, and lifestyles, you want to pass on this game. We would tweak the questions before to suit our family, but it took a lot of tweaking, and now it sits on the shelf. Okay, hey, hey, who wants to come over and play Grandmom and Peep Pop's fucking bootleg <laughs> chicken soup for the soul to Rowdy XXX edition with no references to pop culture? What's, what's Grandma's favorite book? Uh, The Notebook? No, no pop culture. It's the Bible. Idiot. Um, it says the idea of it's. Uh, they're talking about it's a shame because it could have been a great game. <laughs> the idea of looking on the bright side of things is great. That's why we bought the game. <laughs> One of our sons tends to be an Eeyore. Well, yeah, he's got parents making bootleg chicken soup for the soul poor games. I'd say that's reason <laughs> to be depressed. Dear parents, like, might I watch anything, even PBS? I'll take three, two, one, contact it this way. No, we're gonna play yeah. chicken soup for the soul. Our edition. Again. Again, but there's only three questions, and all of them are, why are you sad? <laughs> they made dog food before chicken soup. Yeah. Like, like well, what are they fucking going to call it, Justin? Chicken soup for the chicken soup for the soul? Chicken soup for the tummies. 